want to figure out your maximum heart rate, maybe it's for fun, or you want to know your different heart rate zones to use them as a tool in your training. If you follow a training program, for example, effort levels can sometimes be expressed in different heart rate zones. And in this video, I will demonstrate how you can calculate your maximum heart rate and thus also calculate your heart rate zones. I will run on this treadmill because it suits me well to be able to have control over the speed. But the workout can also be done outdoors. And after the test, I will explain how you can calculate the different zones based on your maximum heart rate. And I will just also say that just in just a couple of weeks, I will also get answers on how accurate this test is in comparison with the maximum heart rate test at the lab, as I will do that next month. Maybe you also have heard of various formulas that can calculate your maximum heart rate. Those formulas are based on average among participants in the various studies, but they do go a long way if you're a beginner or for people who, for various medical reasons, don't feel well from excessive loads. So if you feel unsure about your health, just use the formula I'm about to explain and don't go any further with my treadmill test. The formula we use is one of the more common, but there are several formulas so if you don't like the one I will be using, feel free to use an alternative. The result will not differ that much. And I will leave a link to that study and the formula in the description. And if you want to do a treadmill test like the one I am going to show you right now, it is helpful that you first calculate your maximum heart rate according to this formula, so have your value to use when running on a treadmill. The formula we'll use is this one, 208 minus 0.7 times your age. For example, if you're a 40 year old, you will take 208 minus 28 and the result will be a maximum heart rate of 180. So now that you have the formula, we can move on and do the treadmill test. And I will wear a chest belt so to measure my heart rate correctly. And I will leave a link to the one I am using in the description. And if you feel this video to be helpful, please give it a thumbs up. So first you need to calculate your maximum heart rate through the formula. You will now run for 15 minutes as a warm-up and the heart rate should be near 75% of your calculated maximum heart rate. In my case, the heart rate will be just over 130. 133 and 132. So I think I'm right now running at 132, 133, 34. So that's perfect for my warm up according to this treadmill test. 10 minutes to go. Around 
lift by kilometer. It's hard reaching 150, so I need to increase speed. Heart rate, if you remember, was 175. 
so I think this is pretty accurate for me anyway and that will help me calculating the different heart rate cells. Have you done this kind of maximum heart rest test by yourself? And what did that give you? And do you think it was accurate? Please comment below. And you should have a nice run. And I see you soon. Bye!